Next thing to discuss is that Trump is always the same in each hand. And Trump is always denoted, so there's no um, picking Trump. The Trump is always decided at the beginning of each hand. The highest Trump, I know this may look a little bit different, a little weird, but the highest four cards in the deck are the Queens. Now, as I said earlier, the Queens are only worth three card points, but they are the, the highest cards in the deck. Between between the between the queens, I'm sorry. Um, there's a there's a ranking of the queens. So the highest queen in the deck is the queen of clubs. The next queen is the next um, highest, which is the queen of spades. Then the queen of hearts, and then the queen of diamonds. The next four cards. Um, that are next highest after the Queens are the Jacks. Now the Jacks go in the same order. Again, they're only worth two points, but they are the next set of cards that are higher than the Queens in the game. So the same order applies to them as the Queens. So you've got the, the Jack of Clubs, you've got the, the Jack of Spades, you've got the Jack of Hearts, and the Jack of Diamonds. Those are the highest eight cards in the deck. The last set of Trump, let me just get this organized a little bit better for you here, is you've got all the remaining, uh, all the remaining diamonds. So you've got the Ace of Diamonds, the Ten of Diamonds, the Nine of Diamonds, or no, sorry, that goes in the wrong spot. The Ace, uh, the Ace and Ten of Diamonds, the King of Diamonds, uh, the Nine of Diamonds, and the Eight, and then the Seven. So I just showed you all of the Trump. So if you think back to however many and you've counted, there should be 14 Trump in a given hand.